Welcome to 12 News at 5. I'm Walt Grayson. And I'm Melanie Christopher. We begin with breaking news. Multiple agencies responded to Boozer Road in South Jackson this afternoon where they found one child dead and one alive. 12 News, Cameron Smith tells us this is all connected to an Amber Alert out of South Louisiana. Cameron, I know you spoke with JPD Chief Joseph Wade at the scene. What did he have to say? Yeah, Melody, first of all, I wanted to let you know that it's still a very active scene out here. There are multiple agencies still here. Their cars are up and down the road. I want to take a step out of the way and just let you look here. The chief said that the suspect that they were looking for has been found, and his name is Daniel Callahan. Uh, Byron police helped locate his vehicle, a black Chrysler 200, and led them and the U.S. Marshal Service here. The chief also reports that one of two kidnapped children, four-year-old Erin Burnett, was found dead in the nearby woods. Her sister, six-year-old Jaylee Burnett, was taken to a hospital for treatment. Treatment. They were found in the same area, approximately 10 yards from each other. Authorities tell us the Amber Alert was issued for the two abducted girls after their mother, 35-year-old Callie Burnett, was killed in Larange, Louisiana, earlier in the day. Based on the crime scene that we've observed here today, we have contacted MBI's Human Trafficking Division, along with Hines County's. Human Trafficking Division. We also have our juvenile division on scene because based on the crime scene, what it looks like, this may be a location where there has been some human trafficking done. We see cages, small animal cages. It's very, very disturbing to me as a police chief and as a father to witness and see what I just saw. Chief Wade also noted that investigators have found potential signs of human trafficking out here and as for the suspect, the chief calls him a coward. We'll have more live at 6, live from South Jackson, Cameron Smith, 12 News.